pussies, it's a feline Curious cause he whine Make threats, but like a pretty woman, I'ma be fine Rewind Them big, like not big ass puzzles, but remember you used to get the box with like a thousand puzzle pieces? You feel me? Yeah, yeah, yeah You put that shit together and it's like three missing pieces You feel me? Yeah <laughs> And then you like you, three. And then you might be cleaning the house Wednesday, one Wednesday, and you find a piece. Then Friday, you find another piece. Then Monday, you find another piece, and you be able to complete the puzzle. Okay. The situation came out like three weeks ago with Nunu and Beasley, right? Yeah. And she was fucking Beasley and got pregnant and got an abortion and bum, all that bum, goofy bum. shit, right? Yeah. We found out why her ex-husband actually divorced her. Bum. And we thought it was over. We thought we had all the details, bro. We thought we had all the witnesses. We was going to get all the truth out of the situation that we thought we was going to get. But ironically enough. But ironically, right. this nigga, right, come drop off. Bro, I'm, bro, it's gold in his mind, bro. It's, bro, it's Cheerios in his box, my nigga. All right. I'm going to tell you about the video. So, boom. So, Norbs. So, first of all, the video is called Norbs, The Untold Truth. Hmm. Um... Lost Files. That's now, a long name. But listen. Continue. Remember? Remember? Uh, so. Remember the interview that uh, Unbiased did with Norbs? It's like over an hour long. That's when he talked about suing uh, URL with 40 million. That's how we... Yeah, yeah he yeah. talked about all that. Boom. Why the fuck isn't this part a part of that part? When that part was released almost a, a fucking year ago. It's a reason why that part didn't come out with that part. Because Norbs was like, you know that one part about Nunu? Cut that out. We not going to put that. For whatever reason. Maybe he ain't want to ruffle no feathers. Maybe he ain't want to dig himself in a, in a, a, a deeper ditch. Right. But he said, keep the part about Nunu out. But look at God, right? Out the sky. Nunu get exposed, right? For right. cheating on her husband and for fucking with Beasley. And they decide to put this out six days ago. So, Ouch. listen. So, Nobs get there explaining how he uh, met Nunu. He brought Nunu in the fold. I did not know that. I didn't know that. Me neither. He introduced Nunu to Beasley and Smack. And look how she acting now. Right. So, he brought her in, bro. He recruited her. Right? So, he, like, he needed, he had this little show. Like, I think it was like a little podcast before a podcast. And he needed another mm -hmm. co-host. Well, he yep. needed a co-host. So, he was like, yeah, that's, I'm going to get this female right here. You feel me? Like, she's sexy, she cute, thick, whatever. Mm -hmm. It'd be nice eye candy. Yeah, Boom. Cool. Hired her. He said... Every day, or it seemed like every fucking time we was filming this show, this bitch was late. Just very disrespectful, very arrogant, like, can't never come on time, right? Yeah. And he said he poured it up, like, he told her about herself, like, shorty, you tripping, like, this is a business, I'm gonna need you to be, you feel me, more on time, like, show, like, like, show me you really fuck with me, show me right. you really down with what we right. doing. like, you trying to do this. Exactly. So he said it was just one day. But he was like, all right, enough is enough. I'm, I'm done with this shit. Like, if this bitch come in, she come in. If she don't, I don't give a fuck. So he said he already went live. He on the show or whatever. She come in with DNA, right? 30 minutes late, the bitch got fooled. And she walk in that bitch like, so y'all just going to fucking start the show without me? Poking her chest out. Sticking her chest out like, yeah, fuck you think this is. Like, fuck. Man, BZ, I mean, Norb said he she got... She beat her chest. Man, yeah, she beat her chest. Ape shit, right? Bro, Norb said he got so fucking mad, bro. He got mad where, I don't know if they had, like, a dispute on live. Like, they was arguing while they was live on the show. I think he did say he said something to her. During and after the show. So, after the show, he cut her off. He, let, he had to let her know, like, I ain't fucking with you no more. We ain't on the same page. We can't see eye to eye. You, you too fucking late. Bip, bip, bop. Fired her, right? Yeah. Beasley. Beasley hit Norb's phone. Hey, yo, Norb's. You think you can reconsider uh, parting ways with Nunu? Norb's like, it's Norb's words. Norb's like, yo, Beasley, first of all, why you even worried about what the fuck I got going on over here? This is my show. This ain't got nothing to do with the URL. I invested my money. Nigga, I travel all the way out here to this fucking uh, studio to record. Like, why you worried yeah, about it? yeah. No, just, just, no, man, just, I, like, she's a good person. She's a good girl. Like, I, I, like, continue to work with her. Nigga say, he said, Beasley, I don't know if you fucking her. If you want to fuck her, go ahead and fuck her. But don't tell me what to do over here. So, Norm's like, damn, my 
must have been fucking like what? Like this? Oh, this why she's sticking her chest out. Cause behind yeah. my back, you done developed a relationship with Beasley. So right. now you think you can just come in? You think you just do what you want now? But that also comes from what Beasley then told her about that man. Hey, she, pillow talking and shit. You're right. Probably pillow talking. She acting out the man's. You know what I'm saying? That's how they be. So that was the first red flag. The so second we got one. Pillow talking. Behind the back. Being disrespectful. Beating the chest. Yes. All right. Johnny that's, a Trifecta. that's at least a trifecta. Facts. Check. Bro. And he's seen it already multiple times. Like, I mean, she got prep, right? And a couple of niggas, right? Ooh. That new new brought in, right? Yeah, she brought a few niggas in. That's but she shouldn't niggas. have been running around promising people no PG battles. How the fuck is you going to promise somebody a PG battle him, when you don't control the circuit? Norbs was in, bro, Norbs was in charge of the Proving Grounds. Oh, she knew Easily what had do. nothing to do with that. Oh. Smack had nothing to do with oh, that. she knew what to do to make it happen. Yeah, she sucked Beasley dick. She was fucking Beasley and she got power drunk, you feel me? It felt as though she could promise people battles because she fucking a boss and she figured Beasley.